There's a famous meme online that says the devil works hard, but Kris Jenner works harder. You know, people think you're some devilish mastermind pulling all the strings, but is that what a manager does? No, I think a manager is definitely somebody who organizes all the chaos, you know, and, and tries to come up with some great ideas and, and work together and collab with the kids. People I don't think, to... are you doing something behind no, my she back? She just keeps looking at me and s doing these weird it's faces, weird. so I don't but think But I also think to healthy. that point of you being devilish is like really fun for social media. But like in reality, I have so much respect for her because she deals with so much. Like there's five of us. There's always something there's going on every something. day, if not more. Ashley from Seattle said, what inspired you to become a momager? Well, I think it just evolved from when we started filming the show and things happened really fast and we threw a lot of spaghetti at the walls, but you know, we figured it out. I wouldn't trade it for anything. There's a perception that you are the brains behind a lot of the stories that come out about the family. We're all doing so much and so busy and there's so much going on. I don't even know half the stories that come out, uh -huh. let alone know who I would even call. It bugs me when they say like, if something like really tragic happened or something really sad and they're like, you know, Kris Jenner was behind this. Like that stuff just is like, who would do that? We're such a close family, like it's all yeah. love. I think there's so much misconception on so many things and how we are and and the the relationship with all of us. We're actually just such to the a point close. Where it's very but overwhelming she doesn't know half the stuff that's being said. Which of the kids is the easiest to manage and who's the hardest to manage? Great um, question. Good question. Good question. Well, if I'm going to be honest, the if I'm going to be honest, well, we all only want pure honesty here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think Kendall's the easiest. Okay. She's also the kid when she was seven would put herself to bed every night okay. and say, I'm done for the day, mommy. Very, My room like, is independent. clean. Who's yeah. the hardest? Who gives you the most lip? Courtney. Courtney. Yeah. And is that who you were going to say, Courtney? You yes. said, I, yes. I don't want to do things if it's not something I'm really into doing. Okay. So I... My answer is like no to most things. And if it's gonna be yes, like I wanna know every detail of what I'm gonna be asked of. Tony from Virginia said, do you actually take 10% from every business deal the kids do? Do you ever feel guilty taking a cut from them? I don't feel guilty because I work really hard. And I think that I'm valuable to the deals that we do and the businesses that we create. Our mom works so hard and no one especially at the beginning, would believe, did believe in us the way that our mom did. She really just knew that we can do all these things and my mom is b giving us our careers or helping us navigate through that and it's only fair that she gets paid for that and she does a good job. I think that we all are happy working together. So, and I think if I'm not mistaken, there's other managers out there that take a lot more. You've all mentioned at various times on the show that the amount of attention you receive from your mom as a manager directly correlates to how much money you bring in. Oh, God. Do you all feel that way? 